Hey guys, uh, I'm making a video response to Brittany Louise Taylor on her Ghost Ship VS submission. Um, by the way, Brittany, I really enjoyed this video, and the beginning scared the hell out of me. I jumped off my chair when I seen that. I was not expecting that. It really scared me. Um, anyways, I just wanted to go ahead and leave you a video response. Um, the scariest thing that's ever happened to me, um, not a lot of scary stuff's happened to me, which I'm grateful for, because I don't want to do that stuff. Um, but something did happen to me in my house, um, I don't even really remember when it was. <sighs> um, okay, so one night, it was like, I don't know, really, it was probably about 9 o'clock or something, and I was in my room, and I had my door open, and, well, if my door's open, you can see right out in the kitchen, and I had my door open, and I don't know what I was doing, I think I was just probably on the computer or something, but, um, I was looking, I, was, I just happened to, like, glance out my door, and I saw some white-looking figure, walk into the kitchen, that's all I saw, you know, I thought it was my mom wearing her white robe or something. So, you know, you know I was, so I was going to go out to the kitchen because I, I wanted to ask her something. I don't remember what I was going to ask her, but, you know, I thought it was my mom. So I go out to the kitchen and I'm walking out there and I'm like, wait a minute, mom, where are you? You know, my mom was, it was, my mom was not there. So, you know, I was, so I was looking in the living room, and I was, I think I even walked over to go downstairs, because you go downstairs in my kitchen. So I went down there in the basement and looked, and nobody was down there either. So I came back up, and, you know, I walked back to her bedroom, opened the door up, and she was asleep. So, and, um, everybody else in my house was asleep. My brother was asleep, my dad was asleep. So, um, yeah, that kind of freaked me out, because I know somebody went into the kitchen. I don't know who or what it was, but something went into the kitchen, and it looked like they was wearing a white robe or something. That's why I thought it was my mom, but apparently it wasn't. Uh, that's just, that's like the freakiest thing that's ever happened to me. Um, but there is something else that I was just going to go ahead and share with you um, that I will never forget. That even though I did not see it, it still really scared the hell out of me. Because I was uh, 9 or 10 years old. It was uh, at Christmas time and we was all in the living room up at my grandparents' house. And I was about 9 or 10 years old. And so then my brother was about two or three. And this happened to my brother, not to me, but I saw him, you know, and everybody else did. We was all there in the living room opening our presents up. And my little brother walked over to the hallway because um, there's a long hallway there in the living room that's open and it's just a long hallway. And it was pitch black back in there and there was nobody else back there. Everybody was in the living room. Um, so my little brother just walked over there and stood there, and he was just kind of staring back the hallway, just staring back the hallway, and, you know, all of a sudden, he just started screaming and crying, and nobody could figure out what was wrong with him, and he was just standing there screaming and crying, looking back in the pitch black hallway as if he'd seen something. And there was nobody back there. So, um, that's just something that I'll never forget. Even though it didn't happen to me, it still kind of scared me. Because I was, um, only 9 or 10 years old. And I do believe, and I did believe then, that he saw something. Like a ghost or something. Because I know their house up there is haunted. And you know, now I ask my brother, um, if he remembers that. Because everybody in the family remembers it. Because... It was just weird that he did that. Something else that I, the reason why I know my house is haunted, another reason is because before we moved here, um, there was a trailer that used to sit here that used to sit in a graveyard. 
and it was this red trailer. It was like this odd looking rustic red collar, freaky looking trailer. And it used to sit here where my house is now. Uh, when I was little, me and my friends used to come up here because we used to live right down the road from where we do now. Me and my friends would come up here and go into the trailer and, you know, we'd play house and try to fix it up and do all that stuff. I remember some freaky things in that trailer that freaked me out because I was about 9 or 10 years old. I found pictures in the drawer in the kitchen in the trailer of gravestones and cemetery pictures in the kitchen drawer of it. Just freaked me out. And, you know, I never did really understand why they moved that trailer here because nobody bought it or would lived in it. Something else that was majorly freaky in that trailer was in the bathroom. There was these red stains all over the sink and in the bathtub. And I think it was, uh, I think it was blood stains. It looked like blood stains. I'm not really 100% sure, you know, if it was or if it wasn't, but it really freaked me and my friends out. So, actually, after we seen that, I don't think we went back in that trailer again because it was just the thought of, what if it's really blood? Ugh. Freaky. So then, they, when we, they moved the trailer from here to across my house up on the hill. And so we built our house to where the trailer was. I do believe that that trailer, from it being in the cemetery, I kind of believe that it brought spirits or something over here because um, I think that's why my house is kind of haunted. It was because of that trailer. But that's just something else that was kind of freaky that I wanted to share with you. Anyways, uh, I really enjoyed the video. Um, you guys keep making your awesome videos, you and Shane. Um, you guys make really awesome videos. So, um, big fan. Um, talk to you guys later. Bye.